Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Erica. This is my daughter Madison and we are currently sitting in our basement because we are going to be redoing this basement. We're going to take you guys with us. It's going to be super fun and it's going to be so beautiful. So Madison has been living in the basement. Well, her bedroom's in it. been in the basement for years. For years on the other side, but this room was cur currently, uh, well, it was my other daughter's room and she just got her own apartment and so we have big big plans for her room i will link down below where when we redid this room years ago for elena my older daughter and it was a big hit it's my most viewed video almost at 1 million views and um crazy. i know kind of crazy we only spent 75 dollars to redo this room and she enjoyed it for a couple years but she's now moved on she's 23 so madison and i also redid her room and i will yeah. link that video down below it's super cute it's Definitely her vibe is like yeah, tropical, tropical leaves, but you also like velvet and she likes a little bit like bougie, kind of trendy. a little bit bougie, <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, like uh, velvet and big kind soft of comfy like, throws, like faux fur, stuff like that, but then I also want it very like beachy. Yeah, and you kind of like boho too, kind yes. of like a lot of, <laughs> a lot of styles, but her room before was very tropical and I'll, like I said I'll link that video down below you'll see how we redid her room we didn't spend a lot doing that at all she hand painted a leaf wall that room eventually is going to become my like craft room I'm not really exactly sure but of course that will be another video so I'm not really sure how many videos it is going to take to redo this um, basement but we are going to be doing like some actual construction tearing down walls rebuilding walls drywall lots of painting we're going to redo the floor so right now we're just going to show you a haul of some really fun things that madison picked up today she hit up a few goodwills with her best three. friend becca three goodwills and you will not believe the amazing finds <laughs> we're just showing you that you can do this on a budget you just have to plan you just have to go out and you know do the legwork try to find stuff have a vision in your mind what you're going to do so last night, can I tell the story about the couch? Yes, See this yes. amazing couch we're sitting on? <laughs> it's wonderful. We were like, man, it would be so cool if we could go into a Goodwill and find a tufted uh, velvet couch for like 40, for like, what do you say, like 25 bucks. That'd be so amazing. And then today, Madison went over to Goodwill and she walked in and she saw this amazing tufted velvet, velvet couch, couch for 40 bucks. And it's right in the front, like right in the front. And she called me, she's like, mom, Oh my gosh, she told me, and I'm like, I'll be right over there. And then this woman walked up right then and said, no, I just bought, I bought that, and I'm here to pick it up. I bought it a few days ago, and I'm here to pick it up. And Madison was there like, there's a tag, and I was going to rip it off, but it, I was, I didn't see it, and it had said paid, and she was she like, no, I bought this, and I was like, so they were about ready to fight, not really. I, she was really <laughs> sweet. It. She was really sweet, the lady was okay about it. And then Madison was like, okay, bummer, whatever. But then the lady came back, and she said, like a minute later, two minutes, maybe, not even. And she was like, you, you can have it. She's I'm not like, it, it's fine. I'll just, we can just transfer it. We can, you can have it. And I was like, are you sure? Like, <laughs> yeah, she asked like five this times. Is, I was so nice. Remote. Like, are you sure? She was like, yeah, yeah, it's fine. I don't have a way to transport it. And so I was like, totally. And she had bought it a few days before and yeah. it happened to be there the same like, time Madison right was Right next there. to it. Crazy. Literally. Like ready to pick it up. There was a lot of people in there too. So like, and who that? who would like walk away from? I mean, this is amazing. It's so yeah. it's a futon actually, yeah, so full size futon, and it's, it's actually it's got arms. comfy. It's crazy. It's gorgeous. And I just say God, you know, heard our wish list, and He just handpicked it for us, and He had her walk in at the same time. All of it worked out, and so Madison was super excited. I hope you can look. I'll show you a little bit closer up, but Oliver is clearly um, and it's enjoying dark. it. He thinks it's soft. It has like dark wood like legs to they're like short they're like that big but it's kind of like a cherry red yeah, cherry wood. but i probably am going to paint them gold then we went to a few goodwills because i was super excited too and i had to go along we found some different things so she's going to show you all the things that she found today and we're going to give you prices too so you'll see how incredibly inexpensive all yeah. this stuff is and then we're going to show you befores and after uh, well we're going to start with the befores of the room and then we're going to take you along for the whole transformation so it's going to be in several different videos and at the end i'll try to just put um compile uh, the videos together into a really short or a shorter video from start to finish so if that is the only video you want to watch you can see the whole transformation but we're going to start with some of the really pretty things so she got this for forty dollars forty these Amazing. are like four hundred yeah i don't understand so i want like 
a lots of vases. Okay, the, the style is like boho, but like beachy, yeah, tropical. I don't know. And this big vase, it has like two little chip things on here, but like we can like, turn it, it around. It's fine, like it's hidden, yeah. And then this was literally only seven dollars. Pretty cool for that huge big vase. I've got a trash can that's gold. Super exciting. And you can tell I like gold. <laughs> yeah, this was a dollar, literally. A dollar. Out of the so this is a dollar ninety nine. It's like a wooden tray. You can put it on your coffee table or wherever, just on your dresser. I think things are things look less cluttered when they're in like yeah. a tray like this. So super cute for two bucks. I mean, an obsession I have is DVDs. Which you should already know this if you watch my channel. Like she and I are. It's busy. unhealthy, but I don't care. It really two dollars at Goodwill's or a dollar at the pawn shop. I have a lot, <laughs> like a lot. And so I found a DVD rack with like smaller. I have one that's like double this probably. Well, wow, and I still. I have too many, but it's okay. So I needed storage, and I found this, and I'm, I'm gonna like paint everything. She doesn't have. She has way too many DVDs. I mean, I way more than she has storage for. Yeah. So she picked up a few like things for the wall. So just this picture frame. It, she liked the detail on the edge, and of course, like this is gonna come out. That's She'll awesome. probably paint it. And this was a dollar, so that'll be fun. Yeah. And then another couple picture frames. How much were these? A dollar each. One dollar each. Just nice black picture frames. Where did these come? Where did they stay? I don't know, I just distributed found them by down. Oh, so these are from originally from Walmart and they were only a dollar. So that's cool. She can put uh, these are like eight by tens. So these little mirrors were a dollar ninety nine each, you know, like for a gallery wall and or cleaned just up. wherever. Yeah, oh yeah. She's really into the wood tones too, right? Yes. But I saw these on Pinterest a lot. I'm obsessed with Pinterest. And it's like you like you put like a little plant in it and like a hanging plant, like I just thought that would be so cute. And I was literally wanting these. And then I saw them in the Goodwill, and I was like, I and "What are the you. What are the prices? Were they both a dollar ninety nine, two ninety nine, two ninety nine? So we found this, um, you know, a dollar. You can get these at Dollar Tree too, but that was a dollar there. This one, a dollar, and that's really pretty. It's like a I hurricane. saw another YouTube video. Her channel is Exo McKenna. I'm li I literally binge watch her entire channel. It's so pretty. So we'll, we'll link it down below. It's Exo so good. McKenna. Yeah, and she just made a video where it's like, so you put like. Or baking soda in with paint, and it makes like ceramic looking, Ooh. like it adds texture to it. She's really into that kind of stuff. It's gonna be Madison's cute. a good painter. <laughs> so then she found this. It's actually got like a little thing for a tea light. Did you know that? Uh, there's actually a tea light down in the bottom. So like, <laughs> but that's really pretty. You do find these things like at Hobby Lobby. Yeah. How much was this one? Um, I think that was two nine or a dollar ninety nine. Dollar ninety nine. I'm not wearing my glasses. Also got like that's so pretty. It's kind. Of, I thought it was like a pink, but then I wiped it down, and it's actually kind of like a lavender. Yeah. But it's pretty beautiful. And this is like a super pretty like green glass that'll match like the leaves, the, the tropical. Sort it's of. really pretty. I freaking love. <laughs> it's just. It's kind of like a peachy. I don't know. We'll show. It's cute. Awesome. And the gold handle. Like you would find that at Hobby Lobby. It's so thing. cute. And I feel this like maybe even like Urban Outfitters. Yeah, it's so cute. Put a candle in there. This is cute. That's so pretty. This You found this one. It's like mercury glass. You could totally put like a Bath & Body Works candle yeah. inside of it and it would flicker. Candle. Oh, it would be so pretty. So she was also looking for like a coffee table. Yeah, like a small one because, you know, it's not like a huge room. She didn't want like a full-size coffee table, but she found this adorable little tiny small. <laughs> it's 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 not, it doesn't look so small, but it's actually very small for a coffee table. Especially compared to the couch. But I like that it's small, and I'm going to fix it up entirely. We're yeah, change it. Everything. So that's part, it was only $5. Literally. <laughs> and so the last thing I'm going to show you is she has a little vanity. Not a little vanity. She has a vanity <laughs> where she does her makeup and all that, and she has just a regular chair from our dining room table. But we saw this bench, and I said, that would be really cute if you painted it and recovered the top. Mm -hmm. And this was only $6.99. Yeah, I think so. So it's this, um, you know, just like a, I don't know if it was like a piano bench or a vanity bench. It has this kind of mauve pineapple fabric, which I think is kind of cool and it actually kind of goes with the colors of the room. I do have pineapple Plus the, But there's I so many other things that would be cuter. Yeah. So yeah, I don't know if you have ever done this, but you can go to Goodwill, look in their pillow section. You can find the most hideous, ugly pillow and check and see if it's got an insert inside because their pillows are two bucks. They sanitize them. You can also throw them in the washer. 
but you can take the covers off and you have perfect inserts to make a cover or buy a cover. So they're very ugly the way that they are. So right now. Yeah. So these were two dollars each, but then you, you just take off those covers and you have two matching, they're exact same size. It's the insert inside. You know this couch is gonna be covered in pillows and big splazy. Oh, oh and you forgot your blanket. Oh yeah, hold on. <laughs> This beautiful like, well, blush. Madison's like obsessed with big soft blankets. If you know Madison, know. that is her love language, a big soft blanket. And a movie. Yeah. <laughs> and a dog. And a dog. Well, all of <laughs> Two dollars. And it's like huge. a nice throw blanket. And, and it's that's like, like the, the exact perfect shade. shade of blush. See with this, like with, the, perfect. with the white and the blue and the pink. Can you see it? Can I'm you see obsessed. It? That is a haul. So what the total, I, I forget. Well, I think it, it was, was like $110 or something. But $16 of that was movies so it was like oh yeah so we figured out it was so it was like, under a hundred for yeah. all of for the couch for the all couch, of including the coffee the table couch. everything okay before we show you the room i want to show you a couple other things madison picked up um this is actually a different day but she did pick up a few things today another goodwill this was 99 cents this pretty green because you know she's going to have a lot of green in the room because of all the tropical leaves and this is my favorite thing that she got like in the last two days this was a dollar 99 it's beautiful and this she actually thought was a vase but I think it's you know a light cover and so it won't like sit straight but we can figure out something but she thought it was really cute as a vase so I think that's cool you could like DIY it make it It looks like a sea urchin that's why yeah that's why and if we it. could figure out a base for it we could probably set it straight and then she got this big giant plant that was $2.99 $1.99 $1.99 that's pretty cool and then $6.99 for this gold floor lamp so that'll be really pretty next to that blue couch. Yeah. Okay, guys. So before I get into showing you what the basement looks like, I'm going to show you a few of the DIYs Madison is working on. So full disclaimer, when I'm doing this voiceover, it is October. But actually, these were filmed back in August because she decided to go ahead and start working on some of the projects that she needed to finish before we actually got to building the room. We had some other things going on, our kitchen renovation and my son's wedding. And so this is some of the stuff. These are a few clips of things that she worked on before. So this is her headboard. This actually belonged to my grandparents. My entire childhood, this was their headboard. And Madison has had it for a few years and we painted it. It came from Germany and it's solid wood. It's super nice, but she wanted to strip it down to the bare wood and then she's gonna restain it a lighter color. So this is just, a long time I don't know how many I don't know if it was hours but this took her a long time to get this stripped off so I just wanted to show you the process I will show you of course at the end what it looks like but she worked so hard to get this sanded down to that raw wood and it looks amazing and then these are those um, blocks that I showed you they were a dark wood she just painted these white she's gonna hang these on her wall and then this is her TV stand it was already painted white but she gave it a fresh coat of white and then she's going to put wood planks on the top that are going to also be stained the same color as the headboard and then i'll show you in another video she's also stripping down her dresser and that's going to be the same wood so this is what the headboard looks like so far all those little pieces have to be sanded by hand up at the top but it's looking amazing so far then another big project was to paint the ceiling, the rafters. She took this on herself and it took days and days. It's very hard painting up above your head, but she took it on. She did great. It really brightens up the space and makes it look like so much better. We had fabric stapled up there before and this is just, I can't even tell you how much better it looks with everything being painted white. She did a great job. Then this is just a little table she picked up at Goodwill another day. I think she paid $3.99 for it. It's just one of those like little nightstands that when I was a kid everyone had and then you would like put a piece of fabric over it with like the skirt on it was like a little nightstand skirt. I don't remember but everyone had them and she kind of liked the design of it without the anything on it and so she paint she sanded it down. It was all black and she bought this Rust-Oleum in ivory silk and painted it. This is kind of like one of the main colors in her room this like tan color she thinks it looks kind of like sand and so she just painted this uh with it she's using my rust-oleum spray paint gun if you're curious i always get questions about this it's super cheap it's like two bucks at walmart in the spray paint section it totally saves your fingers when you're spray painting and then lastly i'm just going to show you this lamp shade i actually bought a new lamp and i didn't like this shade so i gave it to her because it matched her colors 
And then she picked up this fringe. Um, it's two yards, and we got it at Hobby Lobby. It was $3.99. We got it 40% off, incredibly cheap. However, we only picked up one roll, and we haven't been able to go find any more. They keep telling us they've reordered, and, we, and it's just not coming in. There's several that are similar, but not this exact one. So she wanted to put it on several pieces, but she isn't able to until we can find some more but she did put it on the top of this lampshade it dresses it up so much super inexpensive and it really gives it like a custom look I think it is so adorable and the fringe really goes with the the look of her room so um, we're gonna go ahead and show you the space but you got to have an open mind because it is a basement and it is a mess and it needs a lot of work but it's gonna look it's gonna be amazing. amazing in day so the worse it looks right now the better it's gonna look at the end okay this is looking down into my basement this is the stairwell to the left is the room we're gonna redo to the right is Madison's current bedroom and then this is looking up the stairs. We are going to actually re-carpet these stairs and be ripping both walls down on both sides. It's going to look a whole lot better when we're finished. But this is coming down the stairs and then this is into the room that we're going to be redoing. This was originally two different rooms and we then we used it as one larger room. Now all of this is coming out. The drywall, the framing, the insulation, it's all coming out. It's going to be completely rebuilt. We're going to keep the cinder block walls are going to be showing on two sides. And it's going to look incredibly different than it does right now. So this flooring is just outdoor carpet we put down years and years ago. That's going to go. We're going to actually paint the floor and rip all of this out. You can see she's already finished the rafters here and it just makes it look so much brighter. But we're gonna get new lighting, new paint, everything is gonna be new and it's gonna be beautiful. So this is a good look at it before and you're gonna be really surprised when you see the after. All right, so that's it for this video. I hope that you guys are excited to come along with us on this journey. It's gonna be fun. I love doing makeover, room makeover videos. They are usually like my most viewed videos. So we also love doing them on a budget because that is super important. So we will make sure to take you along. I don't know how many videos we're gonna have, but make sure, we'll, we'll put them all into a playlist yeah. of the basement bedroom redo. And um, because it is kind of a, a big deal. Yeah, we already redid this room before <laughs> in one quick video, but we it wasn't like construction. We weren't building walls and stuff. We were just decorating and painting. Painted and decorated. Yeah, she and I did it as a surprise for our other daughter. So make sure to check that video out if you want. That was from a few years ago. But thank you guys so much for watching. And make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And make sure to stay tuned for more of these videos. And we are going to take you along. We're excited. Hope you guys are too. We love you. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Peace Bye. <laughs>